What is up, everyone? Welcome back to some more Red Dead Redemption 2. We're starting strong with another Albert Mason mission. I'm very excited to see what we are photographing this time. I don't like how you're at the very edge of the cliff, but don't slip. Mr. Mason! Oh my god, he almost did! Mr. Morgan! You wanna be careful up here. Mm -hmm. And it's real treacherous. Sure. Real treacherous. I've been here before. Have you? Yes. Funny how things turn out. Never quite how you expect, is it? No, I don't suppose it is. What you shooting? Eagles. You know, the oh, images, wow. they really are beautiful. All thanks to you. I'd be some poor creature's bad meal by now, many times over, but for you. Oh, that's my pleasure. P please, you step away from the cliff edge. I'm trying to get an eagle there, there. Yeah, they're beautiful. But unlike you, they can fly. <laughs> Too true. You really must think I'm a buffoon, don't you? You think I'm such a dimwit, I'd just slip off the edge of a cliff? No, He's going to! Well, maybe a little. Please, sir. I'm dense, but not that dense. This area is quite safe. Quite. Quite. Oh! Oh! Ah, damn! What did he say? You are right. <laughs> I am that much of a buffoon. Give me a hand, please. It's, it's not that... Give oh, it is kind of high, Come isn't here. it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that would have messed up to kill him off. <laughs> you know what? Bugger the eagles, I'm going home. You know... I really did get some amazing pictures, thanks to you. And somehow, I haven't quite broken my neck. You take care. And you too, sir. Sorry for all the trouble. Aww. Oh. Is that the last time I'm gonna see you? Okay, how high is it really? See, like, he probably could have broke something, but I don't think it would have killed him. Let's be real. <laughs> All right, that was a cute little inter okay, uh, interaction. I almost said encounter. And then I don't know what I was trying yep. to say. All right, so hopefully we get to see him again. But I don't know. That kind of sounded like a an end to everything. But who knows? Well, so the only thing we have available right now is a bill mission at camp, which I want to go back to camp anyway and check in on everyone because, you know, I, I love to do that. Um, if anything happens along the way, then we will check that out. But who knows, it might be a peaceful ride. For once. <laughs> I feel like either we meet interesting people or we just get attacked by raiders or something. It's one or the other. Oh, and I need to actually... So, um, <laughs> Alicia is so dirty right now, it's kind of embarrassing. Yeah. Super embarrassing. Ooh, well, I hope you guys are doing good. I haven't played Red Dead in a while. I feel like I'm I'm getting too much into the habit of. I think this is just becoming my new casual game. Um, <laughs> so I just kind of like play it whenever I need to wind it down. Um, and I haven't been playing it as often as I would like. But. I think I have a little bit more leeway in my schedule now, so hopefully I can get more Red Dead in for you guys. Because we, I think we're getting, I don't even really know, but I think we're getting a little closer to the end of chapter three, I'm guessing, because we've been plowing through these main missions. Hello. Whoa. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, well anyway, what happened? Oh, I got bit. Oh, God. Oh, oh, I need medicine or a siphon. Oh, suck out venom. Oh, oh. Sure. Let's be badass and suck out the venom. I've right. <laughs> always wondered about this. Right. Now we're going to witness Arthur do it. Oh, oh God. Let's keep this <laughs> Oh, God! You saved my life. I owe you. Not that right. I do. Oh. What were you doing oh. over there in the bushes? Why God. do I have... I gotta get out of here. 
I feel like half of their strangers no. run out of bushes no. for like whatever reason, and then they're like, I no need help. Like around here no more. Glad I could help. Keep your eyes on the ground, huh? Yeah. Do that. Be safe. I hope where you need to go yeah. is not too far. <laughs> Oh my god, is that the- right, Oh, there was a little dot on the map. I bet you it was the snake that bit that man. <laughs> Coming out for more. Yeah, the snakes in this game scare me. I'm not, like, scared of snakes. Honestly, I've held many snakes in my life. But the idea of being bit by one, like a venomous one, I mean, any venomous being, yeah. <laughs> like- a little alarming, so. I, I don't want to run into that in this game. Definitely not. Oh, I just ran something over. I hate when I do that. I don't like unintentionally killing things. Alicia doesn't like it either. She's freaking out. I need to <laughs> watch. I'm going to say this and I'm going to forget to do it. If I do, I will just do it later. But I really want to get express ammo for my bolt action rifle. Now that we have that, I'm very excited to start using it. We'll just stick with whatever ammo we have at camp for now. I, I need to stock up on a lot of things anyway. But eventually, yes, express ammo is the way to go. I'm so glad it's raining. And it's light rain, it sounds so peaceful. Oh, do we have another fishing mission? That's intriguing. I might actually check that out first. Let's see, where do I want to... Sorry, I'm like trying to decide where I want to hitch my horse. I'll do it over here, I guess. It's all right. Okay. Let's see what this is all about. <gasps> it's with Javier this time. What are you doing? Going fishing. The rivers around here famous for the smallmouth bass. Fell I met showed me a couple spots. You want to join me? Ah, I can't fish with you. You're far too good. Oh, come on, come on. Hey, join me. I'll show you a couple of my tricks. <laughs> You cannot deny that. Come There's on, let's be real. Not too far from here that I've been wanting to try out. Glad you're so excited about this. You will be too when you start pulling out smallmouth. I do like fishing in this game. It gives me a lot of food. <laughs> okay, follow me. Easy. I thought you said it wasn't far. Too far to walk, though. No. Yeah, come on. <laughs> He's like, come on now. <laughs> I don't walk around here. We've got horses for a reason, Arthur. Yeah. I love Javier's horse, man. I think I love mine like a little no bit more, but. <laughs> out, just you and me. Probably since we went looking for John on the mountain. Uh, yeah. Already seems long ago. How you feeling about everything? Been a strange couple of months. Hey, you know, I can't even return to my country because the price on my head is so big. This, this is nothing exactly new to me. And I'll always be loyal to Dutch. He sees the world the same as I do. If we have to fight, we fight. If we have to run, we'll run. If we must die, we'll die, but we'll stay free. And Dutch, you, you don't feel like, well, that he's doing things a little differently now? You saw what happened with that girl on the ferry. No fight, good or bad, is one without blood. I know that better than most. I think too many people are focusing on Dutch when they should be looking at themselves. What they could have done better. Uh, maybe you're right. Okay, that, that was kind of deep. The right here. That was really deep of you, Javier. Ha! The other day, I rode down to the Lanahatchee River. I caught some beautiful steelhead trout. You mean the Lanahatchee River? <laughs> no, 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 no. The, the Lanahatchee. It runs right near here. Yeah, but it's pronounced Lanahatchee. 
Why is everything That's in English so funny? <laughs> Make us feel stupid? Oh, oh you're dude. asking the wrong fella. That's so funny. Because earlier in the game, Arthur was like, man, I barely know English myself. And now you're out here correcting okay, people. Just down the hill here. <laughs> oh, my God. Whoa. Mm, oh, my God. This is actually so beautiful. Hold on. I might want to stay here forever, y'all. This, this, this can't be good for me. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? I'm okay, off my horse. What do you mean? Luck. Okay. Pretty country. Ah, beautiful. Come on, let's go mm -hmm. see what's biting. A lot of movement in this water. I have hope. You take this spot, Arthur. I'm going to cast from over to the right there, so we're not in each other's way. Okay. That I can... I can... Where am I going? There we go. <laughs> that I can work with. Okay, what do I want to use as bait? I don't, I don't think I've ever used corn bait. Bullhead catfish and chain pickerel. Okay, okay, okay. Let's try Let's try and aim for a bullhead catfish. Let's get some catfish action. Oh damn, that was kind of far. <laughs> Time of day really can make a difference. They feed early morning or late evening because that's when the insects are more likely to be out. Mm. You know that makes sense. The silence. We're lucky. Got such nice weather. But rain can be good. Sometimes big fish think the raindrops are insects. Ah. Okay then. Um <laughs> Well, I guess it's still relaxing even if I don't catch anything. I was gonna say like the birds and everything. Sort of like staring at the sky. It's your bait, I think. Come use some of mine. Oh, it's not the bait. It's me. I've always been a poor fisherman. Arthur. You and Jose. Just try some of Why are you being so mean to yourself? Crickets. Thanks. Hell yeah. Okay, so hold on. We got five of them. Look, we're about to catch one. He's a fighter. Trick is, let him tire himself out. I was thinking, you remember that stagecoach we held up in Nevada? Yeah. It was a tip from that crooked lawman in Reno. We opened the door and it's full of women and children. Rich, but women and children. So we let it go and read in the newspaper that the O'Driscolls robbed and killed them Ooh. all the next day further down the trail. Yep. You know, way That's back bad. in the day, Homo O'Driscoll and Dutch were sort of friends. Friends? Well, not friends, but they had an understanding. So they were Cole's civil. Main Street got meaner and Dutch. Dutch wanted to try to live a different way. And now, here we are. Oh my god, that's bad. They just kill. Oh my god, wait. Is it. Oh, nope. That didn't do it. <laughs> yeah, I have to okay, wait until they take a stronger up. bite. I felt a nibble. Ah, there we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Make sure he's tired before you reel in. I got him. Might make a nice meal. Well, he can make a meal, that's for sure. I don't think he's that small. He's four pounds. <laughs> Eating baked or pan fried, these flaky meat fish grow larger in females than males. They prefer to strike crickets. Oh, keeping you. Listen, I got it. I got a small mouth of asses. What they uh, but, but, but. <laughs> that's what we came here for. 
fish will stop feeding soon. Let's catch a couple more and then head back. Well, that sounds like a good full. plan. Hip, not him rubbing it in my face. Listen, your bag may be full, but mine's not, okay? Gotta wait for me, too. Another one. I'm starting to feel like this is a competition. <laughs> Why am I not catching anything? That's a good looking fish. Well done. Alright, hold on. I felt something and then I went away. That's not fair. I heard people talk about huge smallmouth in Lake Owangila, west of Strawberry, over in Big Valley. You need a lure to catch one that big though. Oh damn. There we go. Oh, it's fighting. Slowly. Slowly. Another one. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. They're freaking out together. An angry one. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at that. That's a good looking fish. This one looks well kind of small too. This one looks very small. Although it is fighting for its life. I will I will give it that. I do not remember how big the other one was. I think this is about the same, though. <laughs> not bad, you see? It's the bait. <laughs> it Are we done? I wanted I'll to try for that. one more. You wanna join me, or uh, you keep trying for these bastards? Okay, well, no. I'll, I'll join you. <laughs> I'll come. I'm not fishing by myself. Okay, let's go. That makes me feel like a loser. I do feel like a loser, because I only caught two, and Javier probably caught, like, ten. Okay though. <laughs> to be fair, he had a head start with his crickets. Nice of him to give me some crickets himself though. I'll we'll have to remember to start using that. I feel like I'm always trying to use cheese because I like cheese. <laughs> I need to eat something. I really do. Oh, well, why'd you turn around? I thought you were going to keep going. Okay, okay, okay. Somebody donated something. Funds just went up a little bit. What time is it? Oh, 6.49. Do you think there's any stew? You guys have any stew ready? Where would it even be? Where am I going? Oh, it's over here. <gasps> there is. Oh my god, Kane the dog. Long time no see. Hey, Arthur. Oh, I can't really do anything. I don't know, Dutch. All we're doing with these families seems like more trouble than it's worth. Oh, nonsense. We are close to something. Jose thinks so, too. I sure hope so. Listen, all I'm going to say is if, if Hosea thinks that things are going to work out, I trust him. <laughs> it will work out then. All right, stew time. Let's see how good this really is with all the upgrades I put in. <laughs> I love how every time Arthur puts the spoon away, he just drops it on the ground anyway. Boom. Boom. Okay. So, what is that on the map? Is that an S? Is that a Sean thing? Or am I blind? I mean, I'm probably blind. <gasps> Stagecoach! That's what I thought. I saw the wheel and I was like, mm, is this what I think it is? So we're totally going to do that. Now I had oh my god, what is happening? I lost everything. <laughs> my vocation, my faith. Wait, hold on, hold on, my hold on. Family. You guys, and wait. Dutch, and you poor people, I would have lost my life. When did ago. this start? <laughs> this is the fact that Swanson's trying to be serious. I'm sorry about that. And Javier's on his lap. So am I. Javier's comforting him, I think. And yet I, know in a I really think so. You know what, Sean? Oh, do we want to do this now, like at night when it's about to be night, or should we wait? Fuck it! We're gonna do it now. 
Hey, what's up, big man? How much? What are you doing? Nothing. Nothing at all. I brought... Oh, hello, Arthur. Then oh, Mary she Beth. <clears throat> She's doing nothing, too. <laughs> what exactly are you planning? Just a little light robbery, Arthur. Nothing a serious fellow like yourself needs to worry about. And you need to get Mary Beth killed as well as yourself? Away with yourself, Arthur Morgan. We'll be getting rich, not killed. <laughs> Besides, Arthur, I'm so bored, I'd rather be shot. If you insist, I'm in. We don't want you in. We got this ourselves. I've seen you fight, little feller. You can kill any one of us, but I ain't letting you take her out, Robin, not without an extra gun. But she'd be acting, not fighting. Sounds good. Come on, then. Let's go rob this. What are we robbing? The uh, <laughs> stagecoach some fella told me about. Oh, wonderful. Come on, you can tell me more on the ride. Where are we heading? Back up north. It's coming down from Valentine. I know a great spot to set up an ambush. Okay. Just don't start acting like you're the lead on this, like you always do. Wouldn't dream of it. It's because he knows what he's doing, on, to be girl. honest. I'm glad we're going along because I am worried about Mary Beth. <laughs> More people, the better. Not trying to get anyone killed right now. Sorry, follow me. Following. I'm coming through. Like I said, you'll be at the side of the road to flag them down. Give them some sob story. Mm. Yes, of course. Easy enough. We'll be hiding up above. Once they're unawares, I'll put in a few shots to let them know we mean business. Then move in fast to hold them up. Arthur, <laughs> I guess you can watch and give us marks out of ten. Right now, you're at a one. <laughs> Jesus. Can't believe you have to tag along and it's just to keep an eye on the girl. Remember the crap you gave me for turning up at that train job with Marston and Charles? I'm keeping an eye on you, not her. I know she's solid. Oh. All right. Very funny. Hey, she's probably robbed more folk than both of us put together. I wouldn't go quite that far. Mary <laughs> Beth can pick a pocket faster than you can blink. Believe Ooh, me. Oh, okay. So Let's she's badass. Up. It'll be quicker. First time we laid eyes on her. She was being chased by three real angry looking fellers. And we thought, oh, that poor young girl getting picked on like that. But she had a bag full of wallets and gold no watches. Way. Happy memories, I'm sure. That's so, so you cool. Two right about <laughs> that in your journals? Can we get back to the matter at hand here? My job that I've brought you both in on. All right, just over this ridge, there's a spot that should give us a good view of the road. Let's leave the horses here so they're out of sight. We want a rifle with a scope. If you got one, we'll be back a bit from the road. Okay. Search. Hold on, sorry. So, yeah, the I got this. To be instructed by the master himself. Oh, Alicia is pooping. This way. Right now. The road down there, Mary Beth. She ain't blind. Come on, you two. This is gonna be fun. I can't believe Maribeth's history. That's like really hilarious, but also just so badass. All I right know after. she's badass deep Me down, but. Take over behind that log over there. Okay, you're the boss. Okay. Let's see Maribeth in action. I'm kind of really excited. Okay. Should be coming from the north any minute. You're up, Mary Beth. Well, all right, then. You know what you're doing, right? Of course she knows what she's doing. As soon as the shooting starts, get low and get the hell out of there, okay? Of course. Her reaction, valid. Because why are you asking that now? <laughs> like, of course she's got it. Here it comes. I put in a couple of shots to spook them, like, and then we move in. Are you sure about that? Your eyes ain't what they used to be, old fella. If you say so. Coming up pretty fast. Hey! Hey! Stop, please! Imagine if they didn't stop. <laughs> it's like, then what? <laughs> Thank you. Shit. Hey, what's the trick? 
trouble there, miss. Oh, thank God. I seem to have got myself all spun around out here. My horse ran off, and, well, I don't know where I am. You must think I'm such a feather brain. What's your name, sir? Lawrence. Oh, Lawrence. <laughs> Would you gentlemen possibly give me a ride to the nearest town? This is a banking stage, miss. We can't be picking up passengers. Come on, Harry. Nice young girl like that. <laughs> oh, God. And I'm sure we can make That'll an exception. Be good <laughs> Shut up. Woo! You were just gonna threaten them. They seem threatened to me. Ah! All right, well. Who else? Is there one dude left? Oh, he's over there. Oh. Do we only have rifles? That's funny. Or like with the scopes I meant. Oh god, oh god, I can't. The angle's not it. The angle's not it. It's the tree. It's the tree. You know what? There we go. Let's make it easy. They're not too they're not far enough for me to want to use my scope right now, man. I thought I thought we were gonna be far. Well you really think they was just gonna give it up? Anyway, we can talk about this later. I'm gonna bust in and grab the money. No, you leave that to me. Fine, fine. I like the pockets of our dearly departed friends. No, that's what I'm doing. I'm doing it all. Mary Beth, you did good. I'm so sorry they were being kind of mean to you. You're all right, Mary Beth. That was a close one. Mm-hmm. I'm fine. Just remind me to bring a gun next time I go robbing with you two. Right? You were kind of like caught in the crossfire head? there. Okay. Well, at least Sean is smart enough to cover his face up. <laughs> Unlike me. I never do it. I always forget. Okay. That's a nice take. You did good, Sean. You too, Mary Beth. Told you. We'll split it up later. We better get out of here. I like how you swan into this at the last minute and then make off with all the money. <laughs> split up and meet back at camp. Go. We don't have time to hang around. All right. All right. <laughs> My goodness. I'll see you boys later. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Well. We got fifty dollars from that. That's not bad, and it was a quick mission. So I can't complain. Not at all. Damn, I didn't realize how close this is to the camp. Actually, we're not that far. Well, if it's not too late, well, it is kind of late. <laughs> We're gonna sleep, we'll go ahead and sleep, and then when we wake up, we'll kind of continue checking in on everyone, and then we can see what is up with Bill's mission. He's definitely more active this chapter. I feel like in the beginning of the game, didn't really do much with him. So I kind of... I don't know. I don't really have strong opinions about Billy yet, to be honest. I just don't know him well enough, but I... <laughs> he seems okay. I guess we'll find out. Easy there, girl. You're cool, you're cool. Oh, there are some people awake. We'll check in on a few of them. I need a word with you, Morgan. Ooh, oh my god, is Karen gonna be a part of this? <gasps> is Lenny gonna be a part of it too? I can't talk to anyone. Wait, I don't wanna do this at night. Our 
Bill, I'm sorry. I'm going to sleep. It's like almost 2 a.m. <laughs> we can do it when we wake up. I knew if I stayed, everyone I loved would die. I ran. Not for my life, but for theirs. What are we talking about? In this country, I spoke no English. I was afraid. I had nothing except for my fear for I left in a rush. I was starving, feeble, and alone. I thought I would die crossing the desert. I thought I would get here and be sent back. I thought I would be killed here. Instead, I was simply starving because nobody cared. Oh, this is really sad. And then I met Dutch. I was stealing chickens and he, uh... <laughs> I met him doing the same. <laughs> and we laughed. He took me in. And he fed me. And he clothed me. And I met all of you. I don't believe I shall ever go back home now. For this. This is my home now. You. You are all my home now. Oh my god! You're gonna make me cry! Hello, Arthur. Hey. You did good with that graze business. Like I told you, I was born, <laughs> born in down manor houses. <laughs> Let's just hope it was all worth the trouble. Right. Okay, I'll catch you later then. <laughs> okay. Right, you like the new camp, Reverend? Oh, yes. We moved, didn't we? God help us. <laughs> this is all a dream, Reverend. <laughs> all right, well, I should be getting on. This is all a dream. I'd love to have seen you and Dutch trying to rob chickens. I'd say I had the upper hand. Oh, I have to set up a rematch. It's funny. That was such a nice story. <laughs> kind of deep, really deep. Damn, okay. Uncle. Hey, What's Arthur. Oh. Uncle. Uncle's drinking again, and the sky's blue. <laughs> Just taking a break. Oh. <laughs> well, I reckon break's over. Yep. Yep. He's like, now leave me alone. Okay, I guess it should be time for us to sleep. It's a good time as any. Well, let me check on Pearson. I need to get some right. sleep. Mr. Morgan! How are you? Excellent. Okay. <laughs> Why do we have the most awkward conversations with that man? <laughs> What's wrong now? I seen you looking at her, Dutch. Who? You know who. Getting too old for you, am I? That's how it usually works with you, isn't it? You're delusional. Again. Won't even look me in the eye, but you look at her all day. Doesn't matter what I say, you'll believe whatever fantasy you're currently living in. Fantasy? You think this is a fantasy for me? Damn. I do not have the energy for this right now. Oh, it's written all over you. I'm not stupid, I've been watching. Oh, that much is painful. What was she clear. talking about? You're playing a dangerous game. Will you be quiet? I am trying to read here. Pig! Why are they always arguing at like three in the morning? First of all, why are you reading a book at three in the morning? You should be sleeping. Third of all, I'm gonna start looking at you, Dutch. If you're looking at someone else in this camp, I'm concerned. I kind of feel bad. I do feel bad for Molly because clearly it's not working out for her. Alrighty, it's time. It's time, Bill. So 
So. All right, nothing to talk to him about because he's reading. <laughs> what you reading, Dutch? Evelyn Miller, of course. <laughs> that old windbag. Tell him about Evelyn Miller, Arthur. Mostly goes over my head, Dutch. And Mike is even dumber than me. <laughs> Real funny, Arthur. Mike is like, you're right. He's no windbag, son. He is a, a seer. He sees things that we don't know yet. I, I know, I'm just teasing. You're just afraid of opening your mind because you might not like what you find. You're probably right. You know, you know, you always had the most incredible way of putting things. Mr. Miller has a way of putting things. Me, I, I'm just an old outlaw, not prepared to go quietly. Oh, you're more than that, Dutch. You're, you're, well, you're amazing. What is Micah planning here? <laughs> this does not sound like it's from the heart, buddy. Honestly, I'm cringing a little bit. <laughs> Hosea! What you making there, old man? A little medicine. Oh. Green medicine or snake oil? Just who you think you're speaking to. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Ew. If you find any ginseng, I'll make some for you. It's easy enough. It'll keep you well. Even with my illness, it's kept me alive far too long. Oh, you'll outlive us all. Maybe. Maybe. Oh. Okay, well. I have some. So I thought I did. Ah, perfect. I'll make some of that tonic for you. Right. Thank you. I'm probably full of it already. Like the freaking horse stimulant that I have not been able to pick now, up. <laughs> Mr. Morgan, in the ship. We're drowning in mud. For a man of cloth, you have quite a way with words. Words are the very least of my problems. The very least. I'm sure. I love how when it's like really late at night, he seems the most normal. He's clearly a day drinker. I'm sure he drinks so all hours of the day it seems like daylight is worse <laughs> last night he seemed fine when i was talking to him i am so excited about this because i was wanting to see karen in action if she's a part of this mission i'm actually going to be the happiest person ever right now because we just saw mary beth it's karen's turn what is it we got something cooking you might be interested in. Am I gonna like the sound of this? Been cooking since Horseshoe, but you went and kicked up all that commotion in Valentine. Ooh. Now, we was preparing to rob the bank there until you got involved in all that nonsense, and I don't know, I just feel like it's unfinished business. So we're going that back wasn't there. My fault. It was just one of them things. Now, how come every time I get in trouble, I'm called a fool and an idiot? But when you get in trouble, oh, it's just one of them things. <laughs> it's a good point, Arthur. A very good point. Well, right, well, shit! Do okay, guys! To do? <laughs> hit the goddamn bank with us! <laughs> you really think it's worth going back there? Four of us can hit the bank easy, but I ain't gonna lie to you. There will be law if we linger. Ain't it for serious? No, just local boys being rounded up and pressed into action. Meaning? If we go in quick and quiet, we can hit it just fine. If there's four of us, I mean. Y'all think it's worth the risk? It's a bank, Arthur. So? Is the take good? According to the fella I met, yes. It's the end of the stock sales. Plenty of money and plenty of people milling about. <sighs> All right. I suppose it's worth taking a look at least. We should wait until the morning. In any case, I need to change out of these rags if I'm going to be performing. Okay. So, Bill, nice. so she is coming with work. us. It is. We put a lot of research into this one. I hope so. All right. Let's go. Damn, we just waited another day. Mr. Morgan. <laughs> Strauss. That man. The debtor, Thomas Downs, apparently he's dead. Dead? Huh. Well, he didn't seem very well. Cool His shit. wife. 
I believe he has a wife and child. She will assume the debt, of course. Of course. Then you can head up there and collect. He lent them a lot of money. Okay. Gentlemen, well, let's damn. go ourselves a bank. What's the plan then? She oh, looks we're so gonna good. We're going to send Karen on in ahead as a uh, distraction. Then we're just going to rush on in afterwards. Just a small bank in a little town. Nothing that big in way of security. We just need to bring you along as a insurance policy. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> All right. Yeah, okay. Follow me. I like the outfit he put on though for this. He's looking killer. We're all matching too. So, tell me again about this big can't go wrong plan of yours. Oh, it can go wrong. Anything can once the shooting starts. Well, that's reassuring. Like I said, we'll see how it looks. If we can get in all right, we'll send Miss Jones ahead to the bank. They won't recognize her. I'll show you boys how it's done. Ooh, okay. I don't know. Fellers always like a lost little girl, but nobody plays a drunken harlot boy like me. Nita should work. Once she's got them distracted, we'll That's funny. move in. When I was scouting the place the other day, there was only a couple of guards. Oh, we wow. Deal with them and any customers who are feeling brave. And you always fancy yourself as the vault man, right, Arthur? Now I see why you brought me. Hey, I'm more than willing. Nah, <clears throat> best I do it. Oh. And did Dutch tell you I've also been cooking up some deals with them gray boys? What? No. What kind of deals? See, you don't realize, Morgan. I'm out there putting in the work same as you. I've been drinking with them a couple times now. Oh, damn. Seems okay. Looking for some extra security. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Could be something in it for us. Well, just be smart about it. Got a lot of irons in that fire right now. Yes, I know, Morgan. Can't believe you got me going back to Valentine. Don't tell me it ain't hurt you leaving that bank behind. Not really. Work in town and not hit the bank. <laughs> you think Arthur That's has been thinking about a day and night? Like. I guess we went a bit beyond working it. We shot the place to hell. You did, Morgan. Not me. I played it cool up there. Couple of punch ups, dealt with some old Driscolls. Oh, is that right? Like I said, you mess up, it's just one of them things. I mess up. I'm the prize idiot. <laughs> well, Bill, I don't know what to tell you. I know. I'm surprised you ain't already ripped me about that dynamite again. One mistake. And I'll never live it down. What do you need? Head on the back. Hmm. A what do you need to make Just you feel know, better? I got the lead on this one. We'll see about that once things get going. So, thinking this through, Rob Cornwall's train. We shoot a heap of his men in Valentine. We rob his stagecoach. This is just dawning on you now. And now, we're going back to the one place he knew where to find us. That's the genius of it. Folk never look at what's right under their nose. I ain't sure that's always true. It can what's be, though. To you? You're getting real nervy in your old age. The last few weeks happened. <laughs> Forget about Cornwall. He can't have many men left at this point. Got a bit hairy in that barn, but we all walked away fine from that. Didn't walk away with much. If four of us could deal with them in Valentine, and four of us could deal with them after the coach robbery, I ain't too worried. Yeah, I mean, we know what we're doing. Say so. We know what we're doing, but sometimes it really doesn't go our way. We need to move quick once we're in Valentine. I'm sure they ain't forgotten us. Of course. In and out. Dutch is gonna love this. Let's get it done first. Whoa, sorry. 
<laughs> we're all running into each other now. We're, we're clumping too much. This is going to be very interesting. I'm so excited because I know it's going to be so fun. <laughs> oh my god. We get Karen and Lenny? Please. This is great. And I haven't been to Valentine in a while. I keep meaning to come back just to hang out because I do like this little town. no one else recognizes us especially Arthur that's what I'm worried about we're just going in kind of crazy again my favorite dog oh wait they all look the same it could be right. any one of them <laughs> oh shit fuck sorry all right gentlemen oh Here ah! we are. the okay. dog knows me hold on wait 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 oh damn okay we're just going in really low key well i can't grab anything yeah. shit go to work of course well, if Lenny can do it with his revolver, I can do All it right. too. Keep it cool and follow me, fellers. So, we never decided. Is it lost little girl you want, or the drunken harlot? She seemed excited about the drunken harlot. I'm not even gonna lie. Uh, of course, you know I like the harlot. You're the only one. You're a bunch of filthy sinners and the heartbreakers, Zolania. <laughs> now where is he? <sighs> I love you her. Get going. Good luck, enemy. <laughs> we got this. Okay, we're going. No, uh, hold on. Wait till she's gotten real dead. Don't act like you don't know me. Oh, stuck up in here. Not so goddamn stuck up last night. Oh, sorry. Just between us. I I've never seen this woman in my life. Get your goddamn right. hands Go. up. This is a goddamn robbery. Nobody move. <laughs> Nobody she's so move. badass. Oh, my God. Yeah. Unlock the door. I love this. I love this. I love this. It's unlocked. We're good. Get out of my way. Oh, Open oh. goddamn oh. Open it. Oh. My rusty ass revolver. Oh my goodness. Hurry up. I will beat you. Too goddamn slow. Oh my god. I hate doing that. <laughs> I'm a robber now. Open up. I don't know, man. He's Too slowly. You better get that door open right now. I'm nearly there. I mean, he is panicking. Oh, if I were panicking, I'd be kind of slow too, because uh, I'd be like finicky. Son of a bitch! Hurry up! Come on! Huh. Uh. Huh. Oh. Okay. How long is this goddamn fucking passcode, bro? Thank you. Uh, uh, Shit. <laughs> all right, all right. Man, someone come make sure the shoot behaves himself in here. Come here. <laughs> Open the lock boxes now. Ooh, he's got the big boy gun. Uh, the, the, the manager does that. Uh, I... God damn it. Now what? Guess I'll crack them or blow them up. Keep an eye out. Oh, shit. I'll be as quick as I can. Okay, well, what? Yeah, I think I should be able to crack these. 
All right, but you better be quick. You shut the hell up and stay still. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Slowly rotate counterclockwise to crack the first number. Okay. I don't know how slow I need to be doing this. Nice! Just listen to the clicks. Just gotta listen. Okay, okay, okay. Well, as fast as I can. This is slower, but it's quiet. Okay. I hear people out there. Me too. Boys, you need to move this along. All right. I sure am trying. Hey, watch him there. Don't worry. I see him. Okay. Sorry, I'm really concentrating. <laughs> We're still getting a lot of money. I hope this lets me do all of it. Cause I know this is taking time. Oh my god, they're stressing me out because they keep yelling. There we go. It like moves slower when I do it the other way for some reason. Don't know why that is. I'll keep a look out at the door. Thanks, we're almost done. I kind of like this actually. It's like a little mini game. <laughs> That's another one cleared. A time consuming mini done. game. How much longer? I don't know. Like okay, you reckon that's enough now? Maybe. It's never enough. Well, I am ready to get the hell out of here whenever you are. Ooh, okay, this one was quicker. I think I can do the last one if you guys just stay patient and can cover me. Okay. Okay. Okay, I have faith. I have faith we can do this last one. We're good, man. Last We're good. One. Good. We gotta move. Damn, what would you guys do without me? <laughs> I'm out here cracking the code, man. Okay. There we go. Nice. We're done. Mission success. Now we just gotta not die on our way out. That's all. Oh shit. I think. I think we're fine. Come on, I'll lead the way. Let's go. Everybody, stay calm. All of you count to a hundred and keep your mouth shut. You understand me? Wait, well, now they all saw what we look like? Or at least what she looks like. Eh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't think they're gonna be coming back here soon. I guess. That was fun. That was a lot of money. Shit! Here we go! Oh my god, okay. I'm stuck in the back. Here we go! Oh my god. We're not going to be able to come back to this town without drama again. <laughs> it's always going to be the towns that I like. Shit. God damn it, there's more of them. Oh. Hold on. This is not working. Wow, Arthur, you're not shooting. 
You're shooting the damn hats off. What is that gonna do? There we go. There's always gonna be more. Shit, it's just hard to shoot on a horse. There we go. I'm not using the best gun either. Shit, there's a lot of them. Oh my goodness. There we go. The word got around fast. How about this damn bank? Holy shit. Come on, I knew it. <laughs> uh, it's always a train. The train is like a paid actor in this game. It's always got the timing right. Thank you, Bill. <laughs> we're alive and we're paid. Yeah. I don't see the problem. Yeah, no, There's a lot of money. <laughs> Bill, <laughs> this you. is a very good take. That you'll be happy, even if it did come with a heap of trouble. Ah, it was fun. <laughs> no, maybe you're right. Now, go on, get out of here. I have some other business to attend to. Don't head directly back to camp and make sure you ain't followed. <sighs> <laughs> Arthur's like a stressed out dad. Okay, ah oh, shit. Oh man, this is part of the mission? Oh frick, man, I, I don't, okay. This is gonna be terrible. Like bad timing, cause his family is already in deep shit and are dealing with a past loved one. <laughs> uh. Now we got a demand for money. That's, that just doesn't feel right. Oh, I don't like how sad the music is. <laughs> I'm just like really savoring it right now. You guys are gonna recognize me. I'm so sorry to do this to you guys. My husband's not cold in the ground and you've come back here, Archie. I nearly paid off what was owed. Your husband knew the rules when he took that money. Now, I'm real sorry about the way things turned out, but he had a choice. Ain't my fault about the way the world is. He didn't have a choice. He was good and he did good. There wasn't no choice in that. And you've as good as killed him yourself, and don't kid yourself. You had a choice. You speak as if killing was something I cared about. You ever wonder mm. about eternity? You should. I hope it's hot and terrible, Mrs. Downs. Otherwise, I'll feel I've been sold a false bill of goods. Now, please, give me that money. <sighs> Either you got a lazy eye or lack of respect. Which is it, boy? I ain't got no lazy eye. No respect for the lacks of you. Well, maybe when your mother's finished mourning your father, I'll keep her in black on your behalf. You think on that, boy? Well, maybe you shall, sir. And maybe other events will transpire. You best stick to them books, because mark my words on this. Vengeance is an idiot's game. Ah, Mrs. Downs, thank you for your punctuality. It's next to godliness, isn't it? That's cleanliness. I'll have to take your word on that. Good day. Shit. Arthur sounded kind of evil. Still love him though. <laughs> but evil. Asking for money during times like this from anybody is always going to feel evil though. 
It's just not right, but they got a business. It's the reality, I guess. Okay, well, shit. Holy crap, that was 20k? God damn. That's a lot of freaking money. I'm like in shock right now. Oh, okay. I see a few other people that we have not been able to chat with. If I can. Oh my god, there's another stagecoach robbery we can do? Shit. Well, that will be a good thing to start with next episode. Okay, that's going to start a mission. I'm not going to do that yet, but... There's just a few people I haven't been able to talk to today. Oh, she's mad. You're Howdy. You're a silver tongue flatterer and no mistake. Oh, no, I tell the truth, ma'am. I must get back to my work. <laughs> Why are you guys always pissing her off? <laughs> oh, there's something about that woman. Oh, oh, oh for sure. <laughs> well, that was interesting. I guess they're too busy for me to talk to them. Don't know if you saw, but I left that oh, medicine there. for you by your tent. Oh! Thanks, Jose. Thanks, Jose. Me and Lenny brought some guns in. Robbed them off that gang that runs around here. Good work, Arthur. I figure you'd know best how to sell them. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, let's talk more later. Okay. Good evening to you. Hello. <laughs> if you're bored, there's always work to be done. <laughs> I ain't bored. Arthur's always got to say something like that, huh? That Braithwaite job was a lot of work for not enough money. I was just doing what Dutch asked us to. You got a brain of your own, don't you? Whoa, Kane. What's going on, bro? I'm trying to interact with this dog more. There we go. Now we can pet. Pet, pet. Is he about to shit? Oh, he's about to pee. <laughs> Thought he was doing his poop squat. Okay, he's too busy. Now I just feel awkward because I'm watching you pee. There we go. <laughs> no, I can't pat him. He started looking at me. I thought I thought I was gonna go down. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. You do your business. I'll do mine. Good evening, Arthur. <laughs> hey, oh, Tilly, wait. Ah, oh, or Kieran. Good evening. Good evening. Awfully close to you. <laughs> hey, folks. Arthur. Hello. Hang in there. We're on the up. I know. I'm fine. All right, kind of a slow night. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode right here. We've got another main mission. Seems Mr. like Morgan. a big one. Mr. Morgan. What? What? Yes, what? <laughs> Do you think the Pinkertons are finally going to kill us? <sighs> Perhaps. Perhaps. I'm so worried. Oh, my God. He, I thought he was about to square up. He went like... <laughs> anyway, um... I feel like someone always interrupts my outro in this game. <laughs> They're like, no, please don't leave. Um, but I am um, for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. We've got some business to attend to next episode, and I'm so excited. I hope you are too. So with that being said, I would love to see you next time. Bye.